good morning guys so yeah, I never had a good sleep this night because the pillow is very thick look how thick is this and my eye is still uh, a bit swollen and it's still a bit itchy I always wanted to touch so poking in this hotel it comes with a free breakfast the breakfast is egg two pieces of egg right and then one piece of banana and then one coffee so it's a bread coffee banana and egg those are the breakfast but it's not enough but it's okay and the lady dancer she don't speak English she speaks the other language keep on speaking their language and without understanding each other but in the end they give the wrong copy because we like the hot one but she give the cold one with ice so this part of Hoshimel city where we are staying now is like a, a commercial area but it's for mostly for local people here so my eyes is getting better now as you can see it's almost even with the other one McDonald's is my safe comfortable food Whenever I'm new in the city, I'm always looking for fast food, international fast food chain like yeah, McDonald's, Jollibee, KFC because this is the food that we are very familiar. I mean, it's the same everywhere. So, so when I was in Dubai, I learned that there is a Jollibee here in uh, Cambodia, no, here in Vietnam, and so I just check. Yeah, and yeah, there is some, like, uh, one, two, actually I'm not sure how many Jollibee they have here, but there is the nearest one, this one, Jollibee Saigon Star, so I will check how to go there, if it's a walking distance, then I will go, oh, it says 15 minutes by walk, Okay, I will go. Survive! So there is something like a uh, video, movie uh, shooting on the side. I'll go to check. Dorian. So this park is closed. Maybe they are doing some preparation for something like a, a festival or what? I don't know. Okay, okay. To give you an idea, Jollibee is like McDonald's in the Philippines. I mean, there's a lot of McDonald's, but also there's a lot of Jollibee in the Philippines. So like if you see Jollibee on that side, you're going to see also on the other side, it's a very close, uh, you know, <laughs> very near, almost nearby to each other, the Jollibee in the Philippines, like McDonald's, like uh, Starbucks, they are everywhere in the Philippines. And one of the things that Jollibee is doing now is opening a branch in different countries, like I've shown you before, they opened the Jollibee and Dubai Mall in Dubai. That is because there's a lot of Filipino there in Dubai. But here, I am not really sure if, there's, if there are a lot of Filipino here. What I know is that there are a lot of Filipino teachers here in Vietnam, also in Thailand, also in Cambodia. I don't know the name of this park, but Google Maps said it's very near here. Okay, let's have a look at my Google Map. So yeah, I'm almost, oh yeah, I'm very near. I'm almost here. Oh yes, I can see it. 
I can see the head of Jollibee. The same like every other street. It's a very busy street. And that is the Jollibee. Yes, now. One of the Jollibee here. We go inside. Inside, not too much people. So, this is the Jollibee Ho Chi Minh City here in Vietnam. They don't have too much guests. I see downstairs there are just around six tables, and upstairs there is just me and those two ladies there. And I order this spaghetti it's Filipino spaghetti so basically it's uh, the pasta the tomato sauce with a lot of uh, sauces the taste is a bit sweet and salty with the grated cheese on the top and two pieces of uh, chicken strips and the soft drinks and it costs around uh, 65,000 dong so I would say that it's a uh, cheap 65,000 just the basic uh, food that you normally see in the restaurant around the city. Upstairs to downstairs here, and I see that there's a lot of people now eating, so it's good to see, good to know that. So, this is a group of foreigners here, the white people I think they order something like spaghetti or chicken and I don't know if they like the spaghetti but I think they like I'm not really sure because I cannot hear them talking but I see that they are keep on eating the spaghetti if you don't know Filipino spaghetti is uh, sweet and salty and we like that but for the foreigner because I'm sure with the Italian they don't like that our spaghetti they like their own spaghetti the sour tomato sauce that is what they like so we saw a very cheap ticket online with the Air Asia and it's only $25 while the rest are $125, $150 look at this it's only $25 US dollar that one is to Saigon or Ho Chi Minh City going to Penang, Malaysia and if you continue that it will be around $170 including the processing fee including the luggage blah 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 we also have a public bus like this one. Too much people here and too much car and too much motorcycle around. Motorcycle on the sidewalk and there are motorcycle on the road. We bought we bought some stuff on the grocery on the other side of the road and crossing the street is very difficult but we survived. <laughs> 